what is going on everybody and welcome back today we're playing some ufc 4 baby we are back in this career mode with my character middleweight we are 11 and oh we are doing work we're having some fun we're not ranked yet but we're getting there we're making moves i appreciate you guys out there who have been watching the episodes who've been liking and commenting i appreciate all the support i've been having a ball and i look forward to bringing more content more of this game moving forward that all being said let's go ahead and get into the fight i did accept a fight as you can see up there from my man cohen ng i know i know we did actually fight this guy already he did challenge us before we taunted him he came back we gave him the beat down last time but he wanted some more so we're gonna go ahead and give him some more it was a good fight last time i'm not gonna down his skills he did very well he even cut me twice i believe in uh both sides of my face but that's okay that's okay because we did win the fight he did come back i did accept it as you can see this is our first high high fight when it comes to ufc so it's going to be rather important we got five weeks to prepare we got five weeks to promote we got five weeks to get into optimum peak fitness when it comes to this obviously we get 13 grand if we show up we get 13 grand if we win so you know already know we're gonna try to hit this w and make moves so i appreciate you guys and we're gonna go ahead and transition into the fight okay so before we even make moves to the fight i did jump over to the social media to see if cohen ng had anything to say obviously he did <laughs> oh obviously you can read it on the screen there take that time you already know i'm gonna taunt him i'm definitely gonna taunt him because i like pushing this guy to the next level i want him to come out there and be ready so that we can have a good fight all right coming up next it's a ufc middleweight division fight Yes, the sweet science. This guy could have been a professional boxer, probably a world champion if he so chose. He loves the MMA game, but his boxing is certainly his bread and butter. I mean, a guy that was on par to make an Olympic team, and that is in one specific skill set. When you reach that level, when you're winning the national championship, and you're about to go to the Olympics, but you choose a different athlete. Yeah. You decide you want to fight mixed martial arts. It's truly something special. He has the most educated jab I have ever seen in the octagon. He throws the jab. It always comes back to the face. It never goes to the hip. And if you rush him, if you rush him, he has an ability to switch stances from conventional to southpaw and land a great counter right hand that will put your lights up better jab than your guy rosendo sanchez oh it's no. unbelievable he puts rosendo sanchez to shame all right so here he is one of the best boxers on this ufc roster and if this fight was to be contested under the marquess of queensbury rules it would be no contest but we got an mma fight here we tonight. would be talking about a one round fight right. because there are no fighters in the ufc that can compete with this guy in that one form of combat such a great jab the head movement it's never on a line. He's constantly going left to right, right to left. It's like a triangle. He's moving. You can never see a stationary target in his approach. And what I truly love about him is his ability to really dig that left body shot yeah. to try and find the liver to end fights. We don't see knockouts like that very often. This man has done this a number of times in the UFC. The sweet science. Oh, Some people beautiful. think boxing is simple. It is anything but. This fighter has certainly mastered it our tale of the tape for this middleweight fight so a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age with similar height and some differences in reach ready you ready to fight Let's do it. his opponent would be wise to get the guard up here early this man has won his last three fights all of them by flush knockout each knockout more impressive than the last. We'll see if he can keep it going here tonight. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Come here. Come here. Let's go, Cohen. Let's go. Woo! Go ahead, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. All right, so he lands a jab there. There we go. Okay. All right. Really control the fight. Just knowing how to fight behind your jab. 
Mm, let's go. Come on, come on. Come here, Cohen. Come here. Come here to the body. Oh, I was gonna go up top. Oh, I was gonna go up top. I couldn't get him though. I couldn't get him. Okay, all right, all right. Oh, he got me. Come on, let's go. Get up, get up. Get off, get off. Let's go. Oh, he got me. Oh, all side out. And then he gets me back on the ground. <laughs> Cohen, let me up, man. All right, come on. Oh, come on. Let's go. Come here. Come here. Hey, tap your chin. Ta tap your tap your chin. Don't you run for me. Yeah. Right. Come on, let's get this uppercut. Ah. Oh, God. That's what I get for being so aggressive. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, keep your gloves up, baby. Keep your gloves. Come on, come on. Come, come on. Oh, he wasn't falling for it that time. Superman. <laughs> Woo! Come on, Cohen. Come on. Well, no surprise. He goes for the takedown there. Oh, come on. Oh, I thought he was coming in. <laughs> we both missed. Oh, we both missed the kicks. Woo, I like that. I like that I'm getting punished. Come on, Cohen. Come on, stiff, stiff jabs. Come on, come on. Jab, jab, jab. Ah, he got it. He's doing his takedown. I like it. He's sticking to his bread and butter. I like that. He changed it up. This was not the last time. Woo, that was a crazy match, yo. That was a good. Oh, he got me. Oh, he knocked me down. Good. Oh, he knocked me down. Oh, he knocked me down. That was a good knockdown. I give him that. I give him that. Yeah, I, I get it. Takedown defense. I'm pushing the buttons. Ain't nothing happening. <laughs> Yes! Got him. Come on. Come on. Ground and pound, baby. Ground and pound. Come on. Come on. Yes. Ground and pound. He's out of here. He's out of here. Does he know where he is? Does he know where he is? Get him. Get him. He can't see. He doesn't know what's happening. He doesn't. Cohen is out of here. Good night. Good night. Just the way he drew it up. He found the opening. Capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're going to get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moment, you got to show up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 59 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout. Watch, right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory. Okay. That all being said, it was a crazy fight. My man Cohen came out here to fight, and he didn't waste no time. Round two, knockout. This was a good, good fight. I give mad props to Cohen. He did his best. He, oh, he might have got us if we kept trading blows like that. But in the end, I did take the W. I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch. If you can, leave a like, subscribe, and ring the bell for more. I appreciate you guys, and I will see you on the next one.